What's up guys, Trey Kicks here with another video. What's up man, Dan here. I got my boy, Keviche, Kevo in the building. And uh, before we get into the video, make sure to like, subscribe, follow us on Instagram, you already know what to do. We got a very special video for you guys. Um, you wanna, you wanna tell the, them? Uh, before we get into the, what we're gonna do, the man Gabriel is in here, as you can tell. Mm -hmm. So we had we got some, we got some we clips running. We got some clips running in the back. Uh, you know, just, just to get the feeling that he's here. You know, he's here in spirit. And, yeah, he definitely. So, you know, we we couldn't get a, an appearance, but we got a cameo right here. You know, <laughs> in the back. Uh, so yeah, uh, All shout right. out Gabe. Uh, let's get into it. So we got him right here, another SB dunk. You guys seem to love the freaking the SB, the, the dunks and SB videos. So we got another one right here, and actually, I'm actually very excited for this one. Can't believe I hit on sneakers, and I waited all day just for this to for this unboxing. So yeah, we have an unboxing for you guys today. That must have been hard, huh? Yeah, it actually it was pretty hard, yeah. You had it in your bed all day. Yeah, I was waiting, waiting for, this, for this motherfucker just to get here, yeah. yeah. It was like, it's like 9 p.m. right now. I have to get this video for you guys, but you know, let's get into it. Um, Let me get my knife. Baby, do you know Baby talking off right there? Yes, sir. Stay strapped. I actually don't even need a knife. They didn't even tape it. I can do yeah. So much for that. Ooh. Oh, Y'all yes. see the box. Y'all see the special. box. The special quick strike box. You already know. I'm pretty sure you guys already know what shoe it is. Oh, you guys know from the title, but Nike SB, folks. And uh, this is the first time we're both gonna see it, so yeah, it's gonna be our first be thoughts, exciting, our first reactions. Right? Very exciting, very exciting. Um, you ready? Ooh. Chris Paper. Ooh. Okay, okay. Oh my god. Okay, yes. Oh, oh damn, I like this. The inside. Yo, let me get wow. one. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow, these are nice. Oh my god. Hey, straight, out, straight out the bat, this is like giving me like some SpongeBob. Yes. Bikini bottom vibes mm, right here. Yes, sir. <laughs> Definitely a summer SpongeBob. You know, when you're going out to the fucking, uh, the Goo Lagoon, the and you, you know, you need to bust these out. Goo Lagoon. But yeah, you could tell definitely, because uh, I guess these are reminiscent of, uh, or these are supposed to hom pay homage to a uh, Japanese bathhouses, right? Uh -huh. So that's why they did the whole spongy material on the inside, and man. It's like, is this like the, so that kind of represent like a, like a towel? Kind of gives uh, me like that towel. Like a maybe, microfiber uh, yeah. type. Yeah, I, I have a microfiber. Microfiber kind of feels like similar. It does, huh? Yeah, man. And they use it as a loofah to like, like a sponge. Definitely on the on the white material right here, it's, it's like supposed to represent like that tile on the mm -hmm. like Easily, on the back. Yeah, you got your translucent bottoms represent you know I guess water. You know that water clear. Man, the insides are crazy. I, I remember I seen pictures of these. Here. Let me let me pull these out because I already know. The braces. That insole or the the insole. Yeah, yeah. yeah. we're playing around with this one. We'll put pictures right here. <laughs> uh, yeah, man, but the insides, uh, yeah, it's fucking crazy. I think it's like a mountain. I don't know if it's like a mountain in Japan. On the, in the inside of the tongue, they have like a little Japanese stamp. Are you talking about these stamps right here? Yeah, uh, yeah. I don't know what they stand for, but I think... Is it just a different color or is yeah, it's it a different, different color? Yeah, oh, okay. is it so a it's different? the same. It is a different, different symbol. Yeah, so it probably says something different. Oh, and then it, it's like kind of cool. It's, it's like, like it has a little slit mm -hmm. at the, the, like in the middle. I wonder. Yeah, I wonder what that represents. I know. I know. It definitely represents something. A lot of details on this shoe. A lot of freaking. You know, little things that represent other stuff you know the, those sb collabs do not man, mix man we have not gotten a bad one hey gabriel dumb bro <laughs> for thinking the freaking birdies are fucking ugly but you know bro every sb we've gotten including the birdies including the wasted youths are freaking crazy in my opinion and kevin's opinion i'm sure pretty too. Uh, i'm I agree. To, yeah. I totally agree with you. Yeah, man. Lots of details. You have the freaking uh, the FTC on the um, lace tips, which is the skate shop they did the collab with, right? And then you have the FTC on the tongue too. That's the I want to say that's the thing that says skate shop in San Francisco. Yeah, the FTC. That's a uh, uh, what kind of shop was that? I think it started off as a 
Was it a snowboarding shop? I want to say. Honestly, not no, no. sure. Honestly, not you know that. I, well, I didn't go too deep into the history. But... I know there was like a like a story on the the sneakers app, like kind of giving a little overview of the whole collab, mm -hmm. and it showed like the store owner. I want to say it was a snow uh, like a snowboard shop. He took over his father's shop, and then he kind of made it. He started implementing like the the skateboarding stuff, and that's how FTC came to be. Like, yeah, that's so, pretty like, cool. All right, get into the money talk. What's your money in your shoes? I mean, I walk to the money. Damn. These shoes retail for what? One ten. After taxes is one eighteen. What are they re uh, currently reselling for, Danny? Um, uh, this ten and a half I just checked. It was going for four ten or four four hundred. I want to say yeah. Around, I want to say that's what the average is for for all the sizes right now around the four hundred prices. Mm -hmm. See these taking a bump, uh, bump up, so, but we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, I, I definitely agree with the, I mean, with SB Dunks, you always see them going up. Like, mm -hmm. there's, I don't think there's always a down, always a, like a downward trend on SBs, especially on collabs. You, you, you see those. Um, like the Freddy Krueger ones that go mm -hmm. for like what twenty thousand yeah, bucks? Those like, yeah, those are like the grails of the grails of the grails, you know. <laughs> yeah, exactly. man, but it's ridiculous. And then, like you said, with the collabs, um, they won't probably like I don't see them retroing this. Like, I don't, they, yeah, yeah they won't retro not. a collab unless it's like freaking maybe years down the line. Uh, would you cop right now for the resale value though? The resale value, man, it's always so tough with mm -hmm. SB Dunks to like cop. Mm -hmm. If you don't hit retail, like the resale is always gonna be, it's like, oh, no, like you want to, but it's like, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, it's a hefty price, but what, what about you, Danny? You think you would cop, I mean, you cop retail, but not on your side. Yeah, like, this so is, you would cop resale. yeah. Uh, I don't see myself copying these for resale. Like you said, I did cop, but not in my size on retail. I would probably just hold out and wait for the paradunks, the SBs that are the next SB dunk that's coming out. Yeah, man, those those are honestly hard. And uh, I could see, uh, I probably match more fits with those. These are hard, honestly, but I just don't see myself uh, rocking these, like, you know, very often. Definitely don't see myself skating these. Probably gonna be a no for me on the resale, yeah. Yeah, man, when, when are you gonna get a personal man? I feel like you've hit so many pairs of the SB dunks, like, man, whether man. it's on raffles and now on sneakers, like, I feel like you need to get an SB Dunk like that's true, personal. That's true. Man. Honestly, I don't know. Like I was gonna keep the mushroom shoe, but then a buddy of mine ended up getting those, which is like like freaking my homie that I freaking hang out with every day. So I didn't really want to, you know, get the same shoe he got. <laughs> so like, yeah, uh, okay. I'll probably just like wait out. Like I said, if I do get the pairs, you know, I'll, uh, probably I'll keep def them definitely personal. see most. Yeah, definitely see myself okay. keeping those. I don't really like regular dunks that much. You know, I definitely prefer SBs. Do you, you like that bulky tongue? Yeah, like? definitely bulky tongue. That that Zoom Air, you know. Uh, I, yeah, definitely prefer these you know the bulky laces or the rope la uh, the, yeah those rope laces yeah are nice. uh you, you were saying something about not being able to, or like this not wearable with stuff you said it's not very yeah. versatile okay you know? yeah it's, uh, it's definitely a summer shoe you know definitely a summer cough but uh yeah maybe next summer or something i don't know yeah I, I say this is like a like a summer shoe not very wearable i guess even though it does have like the white just that baby blue mm -hmm. kind of throws it not throws it off, but it's gonna be pretty hard matching it with like yeah. Like and then you bit. you do have that silver tongue, you know that bright silver mm -hmm. tongue. I think these are just definitely you know when you want to stunt, and then you just pull these out like once. All right, and now getting to the tray meter on the SB Dunk FTC Lagoon Pulse. Um, Kevin, when you want to take it off and give your tray meter thoughts. Man, I'm gonna just give these a uh no. No, no, no. Like, he hesitated. I, I messed he, up. I he, messed he up. Said, I was, Ooh, yeah. He was ready to give him, but no, no. I, I back am gonna like, give him a freaking. So let's see. Let's see. I'm gonna give him a three. Oh, I, I, a three. Okay, okay, okay. You, you, you agree or no? Um, we'll get into mine. We'll get into okay, mine. Right no, okay, no, okay. Uh, let me let me explain mm -hmm. why. Okay, I I always they always think like my 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 thing is like a little bit rigged. My whole like rating scale, but like I like I said in the like, previous video. I go off like the model if I like it like it's an SB I freaking I freaking love SBs I like the fat tongue I like kind of how, how it's bulky also is it like 
the creative part of it is super nice. Uh, they're trying to pay homage to the the bathhouses uh -huh. in Japan. So do you go stuff. purely off aesthetic, like nothing, yeah, I don't, nothing, I don't, nothing to do with like wear, like wearable, like you yeah, know, no, so exactly. Go pure, no. pure on like you know, like aesthetic, if you're putting it on yes, a shelf and like, exactly. Okay, okay, that makes yeah. sense. That makes sense. All right, you know, I guess I kind of agree, but um, I don't agree on the three part oh, though. Dang. I'm gonna have to give these a two point eight in my opinion. That's where my uh, rating system is a little different. It's not very wearable in my opinion it is wearable but not versatile if that makes sense yeah i can't give these a the full three 2.8 is where i'm at i'm sure my boy gp che would agree wherever he's at shout out oh no gabe gabe be hating on the sb that is true i, 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 I feel like you give this like a two or a one <laughs> i don't know who, who knows who knows should um, we facetime him right now see what he... yeah let's let's give him a quick <laughs> let's, give him, yeah. let's, let's give him a facetime see what he think can you rate these real quick what do you give these bro what do you give these? Let me see, flip it. I give it a tree. Tree? Oh, a three? Good tree? Oh, okay. Damn. That's crazy. You're disappointing. I me. doubted you, man. I doubted you. We were talking mad smack on it. Now don't get me started on that wasted you. <laughs> uh, all right. Anyway, anyway all right. back to the video. All right, so that was a that GP was Trey's a, that was GP Trey right there. I was expecting less, but he gave these a quick three. Hey, man. He didn't even hesitate. He said, "Wait, turn around." Okay, okay. I think if he three. saw these in hand, he'd agree with me. Like I said, but uh, we'll uh, we'll see we'll see later when he sees these in hand. All right, guys. So that's gonna do it for today on the FTC Dunk review. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out our Instagram. We're almost at 500 followers, guys. So please, please, please give us a follow. Help us get to 500 followers. We might be giving a, uh, we might be doing a giveaway. Who knows? You know, just, just have to get us there, mm -hmm. and we'll see. But hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and have a good day. Peace.